Oh, well, could it be any hotter? Gorgeous day. Perfect. Sorry about the head covers. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you're a disgrace. <laughs> that is literally oh, going to be jingle jangle all day. <laughs> This is for you. Thank you so much. And you will be playing from T5 with Andy Sullivan. Brilliant. Um, I would say I feel like a competition winner, but I literally am a competition winner. So it's a fine line between competition winner and fraud. But at the end of the day, we came here to encourage women to play golf and that it's not that intimidating and scary. And that's what I have to hang on to. Very nice. Thank you very much. We've practiced. You've done the competition. It's big crowds, so there's a lot of people watching, but we're just here to have fun. Like, all the pressure's on the pro today. It's just, just about you having fun and enjoying the day and seeing the different side to golf that you haven't seen yet, so. I'm here for morale. That's what I'm taking away from this. A lot of people are like, what is happening here? Is there a spot? I think it's pretty full. Hello. Sure. I didn't come here to be the best. I came here to show that anyone can have a go and that's what I've got to do is just enjoy it. Very nice. Cheers, thank you. No thank worries. You. Thank you. Nice to meet you, Helen. Yeah, you all right? I'd say try and just enjoy the day as much as possible. You know, it's uh, it's one of them where you play and it's you know, everyone wants to play well, but as soon as you, you put that pressure on yourself, it's just enjoy it as much as you can do. Helen is a natural sports person. Um, I know golf is new to her, um, but I hope she's not intimidated by it today. She's got a brilliant swing, which I've seen in full effect. Um, I know it's a bit intimidating with this, look at this huge crowd. Give us a nice little cheer, everybody. Yeah, you see? The crowd are gonna be fully behind Helen, um, and I think she's gonna do really well today. Just enjoy it, I think is the most important thing. Obviously, Dan I've known for years, but I think what these guys get is that I'm a total beginner and they they just they keep saying it doesn't matter, I just have a laugh and like anytime I do something good, honestly it's like I've won the Olympics, like, that was amazing. I'm like, it was alright, but I'll take it. <laughs> with such unbelievable strength and accuracy. To him, a bad shot, for me, is like a worldie. I'm like, that was incredible. And he's like, nah, that wasn't good. And when he hits it right, it sounds right, it looks right, it just is right. Yeah! Woo! Great shot. Uh, it's you seen me play over the last six months. Crowds are not my strong point. On my own, I'm fine. Snuggle in. Oh, okay, how are you Yeah, that for me is absolute highlight and I'm crediting the girls. The girls are at 14 and it's been my best hole so far. Um, yeah, I like the short holes and the guys have just been so good from the start. They've said it doesn't matter, just enjoy it. And as soon as the pressure's off, you can enjoy it. And that's clearly when it goes okay. I mean, what a treat today's been. Watching Helen play, representing the Slingsby Academy and absolutely smashing it as well. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, it's amazing. I feel like a proud mother. It's, uh, it's been incredible. I and mean, what an experience to come here. It's a genuine honour and, you know, she's done incredibly well. <laughs> has been unbelievable. I always knew she was great, but to do it, the way she's played today has just been fantastic. So impressed and so proud of her. The aim was to encourage more women to play golf. I think we've definitely achieved that. I've loved every minute of it. Barry, good old Baza, my coach, he's now a friend for life. And the ladies as well, like we've made such a strong bond. And I hope that it's something that we can continue to do together. We are breaking down barriers. We're trying, we're doing our very best. Um, hopefully, look, if one person uh, picks up a set of gold clubs and, and has a go because of this initiative, then it will be worth it. I thought when we started this that it would just get people talking, get women talking about it, like, oh, maybe I could give that a go, but if I can do it, they definitely can. So for me, I feel like we have delivered. My nephew started playing golf, you know, he's only 10. This has inspired him to take up golf. I just want to make it more accessible for everyone to get involved. And I feel like we have achieved that. Oh. I look like I've got a massive on class. <laughs> it's gone all right. <laughs> Not a fan of the pressure, but I've quite enjoyed it. And the boys have been great. It's just been, yeah, it's been a couple of holes where we've all flagged a bit. I think that's just the heat, but everyone's in the same boat. Well, so that. it is what it is. That's right. It's unbelievable, I was saying early doors after just playing golf for six months and to be that good at it straight away, it's, it's impressive, really impressive and to be fair, she was the absolute stalwart of our team. If we didn't have her today, there's no way we were scoring what we have so um, fair play to it, it's been brilliant, absolute pleasure. I don't really know what more you can say about Helen Skelton. She's, I'll whisper it quietly because she's only over there, but she is an amazing person and I think she's actually Wonder Woman. When you've never played golf before, six months ago, to play the golf that she has and to score as well as she has is truly phenomenal. And throwing the fact that she's six months pregnant as well and she's been great company, proper laugh, had a real giggle and I think she's really enjoyed it. And hopefully, if you're watching this and you've never played golf before, this is what it's all about. Six hours of golf, six months to learn, six months pregnant, what felt like 66 degree heat. <laughs> Everybody's been so nice and so accommodating and I kind of didn't want to, I wanted to do your hard work justice. And I think we can walk off with our heads held high. You've just done amazing. Well, that's your work. You birdied a hole in front of a stand, <laughs> like, <laughs> that's ridiculous. Why weren't you over there for that one? That was a Wentworth Prime shot. Oh, that was a Wentworth Prime shot. Wow. Oh, great shot. Come on then, let's have a drink. I think life's too short to overthink things and miss out on something that could put a smile on your face. And with that in mind, just have a crack. What's the worst that can happen? You might hit it in the bush, you might hit someone on the head, you might top it off the tee. This is not the end of the world, is it? <laughs>